keep getting coke in my mustache, guys. <laughs> Eric L. Match coming up. Match number four. PMPL finals. Let's go, guys. This is it. Eric L. Coming up. We got a map and we got players and there's a lot of numbers and that means stuff is happening. God. Damn, I love esports. So we got a line going across the map. That means that's where the plane is. And the plane is filled with people. And the people jump out of the plane and they land on the earth and they shoot each other. It is a complex system. Only geniuses can play this game. It's like chess, but better. X set, 118 points pulling away, baby. Can the Pittsburgh Knights crack the 100 point mark here? Can Lazarus keep up? Can Mazexus skyrocket up into the top three? Will Syndicate and Nova stay in the hunt? And will all the others be able to even just keep up? All I can say is I'm teeing Ogilvy and they have 18 points, but let's see if they can get more than 18 points. And of course, we got the good old fashioned hot military zone, baby. We got Panthers going down early, trying to cross the bridge. We've got teams flooding down in vehicles. How the hell do these guys have like four cars? What? Wait, hold, hold on a minute. Hold on. What? What's going on? How do these guys have four cars already? I land on the freaking map and I play for like 30 minutes. I can't find one car. How do they, how do they already have like multiple vehicles? They got a freaking convoy. This guy found a McLaren. What? Are you kidding me, dude? I literally land at school and there won't be a single car in your apartments, near Ralzak, not in the freaking road all the way down to Pachinki, not in this garage spawn like to the west or the east. What? Like, they literally got teams that have full four car strats like the first two minutes of the game. Huh? They land on car spawns. I land on car spawns. And you know what happens on the car spawns? The sp cars don't spawn. There's no spawned cars in the car spawns when I land. Yeah, we're going to have bridge camping for days, bro. These guys are going to get looted up. Nova Esports has one shotgun. That's pretty good. I think they're set. They got a Thompson and a sniper. That seems like a good loadout. Panthers taking military early. What do you think of the new sports car? I think it's uh, I think it's a car, and I think it's sporty. We've got Syndicate at Georgia Pool. They're going to be looking at the crates. We've got X set down at Novo. They're going to also be looting. Everyone is looting. No one's died yet because they're looting. Fun fact, no one has ever died from looting. They've never tripped on anything and fallen and hit their head. No one has ever died from looting. All right, let's go. Let's go. It's go time. Ghost Gaming now moving across open field, two-car strat, looking to put some good ground between them and the enemies. Uh-oh, we've got Ogilvy. Ogilvy having a hard time. Are they going to get clapped again or are they going to win this game? Ogilvy is literally in last place by a lot. Average kills 1.3. Look at that. They kill on average 1.3 people. How do you kill a 0.3 person? How do you kill a third of a guy? Like, you just, like, ruin his day? Like, you kill him, like, inside? Like, you tell him he's ugly and it, like, hurts, but he doesn't die? <coughs> How do you kill a third of someone? Like, you, like, cut their leg off, but, like, leave them? How do you kill 1.3 people? All right, though, we do have the Illuminati moving up to the farm compound a little bit west of the Novo Bridge. Everybody's getting into position here. The big gamble is will the zone go above or below the water? Will it go to the island or will it stay on the mainland? It is a risk. These guys are all going to go for the swim. Look at that. This is aggressive here. Yeah, Lazarus is going to literally go underwater and swim across. That That's a ballsy move. They don't want to take the boat because in a lobby full of professional players, dude, one mag, bro, and that boat is gone, dude. Syndicate moving up into Gotka, scoping it out, looking for any enemies. They are not there, so they might stop. They are out of zone, though, so they can't stop for long. We've got T9 coming down, fully loaded. Carnage with the M249 with the extended mag, 150 bullets, bro. Carnage has been in the PUBG Mobile Pro scene, like, just as long as anyone, man. He's been doing this since 2018, bro. Professional mobile gamer. Ah, uh, there it is. We got Uwu. Team Uwu is at the, uh, the little ridge. I can't remember their name. Uyu. It's Uyu. They kill 2.67 people per match on average. They kill two-thirds of someone. They tell them they're ugly and they cut their leg off. That just kills you, you know? Not, like, literally, but it hurts. All right. Let's go. We've got more players doing stuff on the map with things to try to get points to win the game. That's uh, that's my expert analysis. Don't forget, guys, the Impossible Insanity Challenge is coming up. If any team at all, anybody, any of these 16 teams right here, if any of them win this game, I will eat a chicken sandwich. That's my challenge to this stream. It's I know it's impossible. Look at that. Oh, my God. Everybody thinks it's going to military. They're all going down on the island, dude. Please, PUBG Mobile, please make that circle go up there, bro. 
Put it at shelter. Put it at farm. Put it at milta. Just to F with everybody, bro. Give me that spicy. Oh, yeah, baby. That's the spicy zone. That's exactly what I was going to say. They don't know, bro. They don't know. It's half and half, my guy. This circle, there is enough land that the next zone could go north still. It could be Pachinki. It could be farm. It is possible. We got ourselves a spicy zone, my friend. Just like this spicy McChicken sandwich I'm about to eat if any team wins this game. Come on, baby. Give it to me. Oh, you look at this. Oh, he's getting the good shots on the buggy. He's going away. Can he clip him? Can he clip him? He might have lost a tire there. Yeah, Sam losing a back tire. Losing both of the tires on the right side. Has to bail here. And this is not looking good right now. 19 Esports having a hard time getting across the military bridge right now. Having to smoke out their position. They've got the buggy in the back. And it looks like there may be a team. Yeah, up on the side of the bridge. This is a great spot, but he is exposed. He could get shot in the back. Looking out for boats right now. Teams are in desperation mode. They're going to have to back off and try to cross the bridge in another way. There is a boat on the side, but this is gonna be tricky. Do they have what it takes to take the boat all the way around the outside of the island and crash on the beaches of Normandy on the southern part of the military island? We will see. Trying to figure out what they're gonna do here. Every team almost has gone down to the military island, but this circle, I have a feeling, is gonna yoink back up to the top, bro. Uh-oh. All right, here we go. Sam is in trouble. He's inside this house right now. He's gonna back off, and he's pretty much dead. Enemies whipping around in the buggy. He's gonna get the first knock. He's gonna get hit up quite a bit. He's gonna hide behind the dumpster. Oh my god, he's teleporting to a new dimension. Oh my god, dude, what is happening? He's going into the nether portal. He got the first aid off, though. They're gonna try to get the reds right now. Another player peeking around the side. It's a 1v4. Can 19E Sam get that nice four piece? He got him down low. They're gonna push around the other side right now. Here comes 19 Esports coming to back him up right now. They're gonna push through the house right now. We got a multi. Oh my god, there's like three different angles right now. There's camera angles everywhere. Oh, he's over here shooting over here. This guy's inside. He's manning. They're outside the house right now. He's coming around the corner right now. He's got the buggy. He's gonna shoot through the window. No, he's back behind the dumpster. He's coming around to the top. And he's going inside. He's gonna try to shoot through the window right there. He's gonna get knocked. Oh my god, it's a white piece. Got to it. <gasps> Frag grenade coming on the inside right now. That is going to be good. I think that was a confirmed knock right there. Here comes Carnage. Zooming in with the freaking UAZ. He's going to back up his teammates right now. He's going to get that side angle. He's coming in with the side. Here comes the frag grenade. He's got that M249. Here comes the frag. He's sliding in the window. Sliding in the window. Going for it. Going for it. Boom. Bam. Not going to connect. But oh my God. Just like that. 19 esports. They were on the ropes, bro. His teammates knocked. He can't get the pickups. Carnage. His first teammate's dead. He's empty in the bag right now. The utility coming out. All the frags he saved up for the end game. He's wasting them right now, but he's going to try to get the pickup. Can he get the res right now? Just an absolute bloodbath. There's still 16 teams alive. These guys are going to go out first. This is not good right now. 19E, they've lost two members. And it looks like they've been getting in a fight with Ogilvy. Let's go. Team Ogilvy, they're in the absolute god freaking last place right now. They need this fight more than they need anything they've ever needed in their lives. Carnage getting another knock with that frag. How many frags does this guy have? This guy literally has like 15 frags. On the push. M249. Getting some shots. Here comes. He's at the door. Holding it. They're going for the jump. Ken Carnage and 19 Esports get the two piece on Ogilvy. The 2v4. He's got the double knocks. Triple knocks. Ogilvy's about to get absolutely embarrassed on international television right now. I can't handle the stress. He's so nervous. He, he's freaking throwing a frag. He's getting the pre-fire. Coming around the backside. Pre-fire again. Missing every shot. Ogilvy. Oh, my God. They're in last place, and they go out last, bro. These guys can't catch a break, bro. God damn, bro. Ogilvy. Who invited these guys? What's going on? They need some help. They need some milk, bro. Oh, my God. All right. Anyway, back to the match. Come on, PUBG Mobile. Let me cast PMPL, bro. Just one time. Just one time, bro. Just let me bring the energy. Let me bring the heat, bro. Please. I need it. Like these, I love these casters. I love Zute. I love, they provide the strategy and the insights, bro. They're so smart. I like, I love them, but they're over here and they're like, well, all right, guys, we have Nova Esports coming in and they're going to be crashing the compound. Oh, look at that. Ghost Gaming getting the knock. Phenomenal. They are now up to 400 damage on the day. There's an airdrop in the vicinity. Are they going to risk it and try to get themselves a crate weapon? Oh, Oh, jolly good show, Lazarus getting a knock there. Great job, Obeo. Looks like he's getting a knock in the feed, man. Cut the crap, bro. Bring one sanity. Let's bring the goddamn heat, baby. Woo! I can't do this for two more games. I'm gonna lose my voice, bro. B-Town, bro, just got taken to Z-Town. 
They got eliminated. I don't even know what that means. What is Z Town? They got taken to E Town for elimination. Look at this. Smoke's pouring out of the backpacks right now. Teams are getting. Oh, oh, oh! Wait, it happened! It happened! It happened! It happened! It happened! The circle went back north! The circle went back north! Ah! Oh my god, dude! These teams just got jabated, bro! They all went to Military Island, and the circle went back north! Oh my god, bro! That's freaking hilarious! Look at that! I told you guys! I told you! Expert analysis freaking with Sandy bringing in the heat, bro! I told you guys, it was possible there was enough land that the zone could go back to Pachiki. I freaking said it! I called it! I called it, bro! All these teams on military right now are getting ganked, bro. They're not getting back across the water. They're not gonna make it, dude. They're all dead, bro. Look at the bottom of the leaderboards. They're getting... Wait, he's driving the Tesla in the water. It's an electrical vehicle. It's gonna... It's gonna short circuit, bro. You can't put that there. He just fried that Tesla, man. I can read zones. I can literally read zones, baby. I told you guys. I said, give me that spicy zone. Make it go back. All those teams went across the bridge. Nah, nah, nah. That's not where that's going, bro. All right, boring protocol might move over and try to try to pick up a kill here. It's a free kill point, you know? Oh, that guy's in the Tesla in the water. He's in the Tesla in the water. Do it. Do it, you freaking psychopath. You crazy man. Shoot him from out of the Tesla underwater, dude. Do it. You know how crazy that would be? Oh, man. All right, he's stopping for the pickup. Sheesh! C got getting the knock there. Great job using that UMP. Probably the strongest SMG all around here in PUBG Mobile right now. He's gonna move over into the smoke. Bring the UAZ, try to get some cover. We still got 37 players alive, 13 teams. If you go out now, there's no placement points. So this is make or break. Day two of the finals, PMPL match number four. Only two games to go after this match. So if you're not getting points now, you're running out of options. You're running out of time, bro. It's now or never. Make or break, baby. Literally billions of dollars. Wait, hold on. Am I not allowed to say? Oh, this is a sponsored stream. I'm not allowed to say billions. I'm not allowed to. Uh, there's a lot of money on the line. It's not billions. Maybe next season. We got Panthers coming in with the coop. Come on. Where are you? You're a professional PUBG Mobile player, bro. You're, you're so, PUBG Mobile is giving out so much money. How do you not have a coop skin, my guy? Come on. You didn't even get like the, the white McLaren, dude. Come on. Pro players should have skins, man. You know what? I know everybody says, oh, skills, no skins. But you know what? It's nice to have skills and skins. Why not clap somebody and flex on them? You know, a little bit of both. Best of both worlds. Well, here we go. We got, just like before, there's more numbers and there's a lot of players and there's a different circle this time. And the people inside the circle are about to move to another circle. Oh, look at that. You guys got you baited. Inside the circle was another circle. And then you open that circle and it's another circle. It's never ending circles until it shrinks into nothing. This circle is definitely pretty circly. All right, we got Pittsburgh Knights here. They are still full strength. They have five kills so far, but they are uh, gonna be dealing. Oh, what's this? We've got Illuminati coming up, crashing on Xset. Look at that perfect knock in the second floor of the sniper tower. Xset, J7 jumping down, finishing him off, bro. Oh, no, he's not done yet. He's gonna get knocked upstairs. He's gonna get instant thirsted, bro. These greedy thirsters, man. They're, they're going for those points, man. Every point, make or break, could be the difference between first place and last place. That's right. The difference between first and last is one point. And now we've got a 1v1, dude. An all-out bloody affair. These teams do not want to go out right now. There's still nine alive. Placement points are not very many, if any, at all. HH24 on the coastline, hiding in the rocks with the Molotov. Zone is shrinking. Knights coming in to crash. They've got a great positioning, but they're just outside of zone here at the barns. They've got to move up, rotate around the eastern side of the zone. But over on the northwest, we got smokes everywhere, bro. It's like a forest fire out here. You can't even see through the haze right now. Team's moving up, trying to gain ground. The circle's shrinking right now. Everybody, it's a mad dash, jockeying for position. Where are they gonna go? Where are they gonna come to a rest? It's Newton's fifth law. An object in motion is likely to stay in motion. And an object not in motion doesn't get the goddamn chicken dinner. It's just physics. Panthers up at the top. They got the high ground. Oh, man, look at the third, 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 third party, bro. He was going to shoot somebody else, but he got ran over by a car. Oh, my God. Ghost Gaming eliminated. Going out in ninth place. They were in seventh on the leaderboards. Not a great finish for them. Trying to see who can survive these clutch minutes, these fading moments. Oh, my God. It's absolute chaos everywhere you look. Every turn behind every tree, every corner. There's a snake. Still 20 players up standing in the zone. Circle still closing. Molotov up the hill for Panthers. Making a run for it. Does not have any smokes. This is just chaos rushing the beach. Just trying to get the hilltop, bro. King of the hill. Who can make it? And who is gonna die? 
we have uh, WSBD. Moving up. They've got the cars and the trees at the top of the hill. It's a good position. And we're about to see the next shift of the zone. Where's it going to go? Pretty centrally located, though. Still lots of teams out of the northwest. They're going to be moving in around the outside here. Coming down through the west. Not a lot of building cover. I believe we have no more compounds left in the zone at all right now. The smokes are pouring out. Who is going to have smokes left even for the end of the match, man? No time to loot. You're killing people. You're not getting to the bodies. You're not getting loot, man. You got to keep that head on a swivel. Moving up these uh, uneven terrain. A couple little ridges. Some bumps in the ground. A few trees. Not much to work with here. All right. We do have a few buildings left in, but they're not going to be in much longer. 11 seconds to go, man. This circle just closed, and it's already moving again. Carnage and Leon keeping 19 Esports' hopes alive right now. They wiped Ogilvy down below military. They made it across the water against all odds. Circles have been shifting away from 19 Esports the entire time, but they've been able to keep up. And now they're going to be pushing this compound that has two different teams. We've got Illuminati and we've got Xset at the exact same sniper tower. Three different teams occupying the same building all out of zone with a moving circle. It doesn't get any hotter than that. 19 Esports keep in the low ground. They've got the blue behind their back. They've got a few vehicles, but at this point, using vehicles may not be a smart idea. The circle is super slow. Carnage gonna get knocked. That's pretty much it for Carnage. Not gonna get revived here. Leon trying to get a spray right now. Is he, he is gonna go for the revive. Carnage is telling him, don't do it, bro. Don't do it. It's not gonna work. The blue zone is shifting. Carnage is gonna have to get up. He's gonna have to move to circle. No time to heal. Enemies above him on the hill. I think we have Syndicate on the hill there too and look at this pittsburgh knights in a phenomenal position they've got zone and look at that. actually 19 esports they are going to take the vehicle it is a risky play they're going to be wrapping around the southern part of the zone while syndicate taking shots at them crashing into a compound and they're gonna get absolutely wiped off the face of erangel getting shot out of the buggy 19 esports going down syndicate going down a play zone that is a kill no kill points there for syndicate because he died to zone no one's gonna get credit for that kill here and we got three teams alive Nine players still standing though. Xenix for Knights moving in, trying to grab the tree. They've got it smoked out. There's an airdrop too. That airdrop may come in handy, not for the weapon, but because of the hardcover. They can crash that drop and they are having a hard time right now. We've got Wall Street Bets looking to clutch up a chicken dinner here. Eight alive, full Wall Street Bets versus a full Pittsburgh Knights finish. 4v4 hot finish as Xset went down there in third place for this particular match. This is gonna be hot, my friends. Oh, you love to see it when they say they scrim it out. 4v4, the TDMs, bro, the bragging rights. This is where it all comes into play right now. No excuses. You've got, they've got zone, they've got cover, they've got a full team. This is a pretty equal standing right now. I feel bad. Pittsburgh Knights, that zone did shift a little bit away from them uphill. They still have a ton of smokes. Wall Street bets laying down the frag grenades trying to clear out the backside of that tree. Pittsburgh Knights still with more smokes. Here comes the McLaren push. Driving up, gaining ground. Every meter counts. Alucard now coming in with the late rotation. They're getting some good shots. They're moving up underneath the ridge here. They're closing in. Can PK take this hill? Can they move up to the top of Mount Olympus? Clearing out Wall Street bets, bro. This is Occupy Wall Street right now all over again. And there it is. Pittsburgh Knights coming in. They said, we don't have zone. It doesn't matter, bro. Smokes, cars, the push, the low ground, high ground. Doesn't matter. Chicken dinner, baby. You love to see it. PK, they're going to be skyrocketing up the leaderboards with that one. And I'm eating another chicken sandwich. Let's go, baby. It's PMPL. This is PUBG Mobile at its finest. Ain't never seen it done like this before, baby. Mobile gaming, it's the best, bro. Nobody does it better. I don't care. Freaking COD Mobile Free Fire. I don't care about those games. PUBG Mobile is on a league of its own, dude. They're up there, bro. Sheesh. That was awesome. That was just, I, 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 I gotta say, guys, I just really enjoyed that. You know, I just had a lot of fun watching that, so good job. Good job, everybody. Well played. I think they should all get a participation trophy, you know? Super cool. PMPL, what does it stand for? It stands for PUBG Mobile Potato Llamas. That's what it stands for.